Staying on top of a local health alert for you this morning, a measles outbreak has infected more than 100 people in 21 states. The growing number of cases is the Center for Disease Control and local health departments concerned this morning, and for good reason. CW30's Janae Francine is joining us live in Midtown Memphis this morning. Janae, people are affected right here in, in the Mid-South. Out of the 107 measles cases so far this year, two of those come from Arkansas and Tennessee. The Center of Disease Control tells us most of those cases come from unvaccinated patients. Measles is an airborne virus that spreads through coughing and sneezing. Symptoms show up 10 to 14 days after exposure. It includes a high fever, cough and runny nose, followed by a rash that typically starts on the face, then spreads to the rest of the body. In severe cases, it can lead to pneumonia and brain swelling. In 2000 measles was declared eliminated from the U.S. because of a vaccine. But every year measles returns through unvaccinated Americans and foreign travelers. There are measures you can take though to protect yourself. I don't know of any vaccine or anything that is 100 percent. But two doses of measles vaccine is about 98 percent. That's pretty good. And I would strongly advise people to take advantage of the vaccines that we do have available. The Arkansas-related case happened in January at the University of Arkansas for Medical Sciences. Reporting live in Midtown, Jean A. Francine, CW30 Morning News.